Hello, everybody. Today's Hot Wheels 2023 International P Case unboxing is brought to you by A and J Toys. Ken sent it over. You can see it got a little bit of a some damage here. We always our agreement is when he gets a damaged case, he sends it over um, so that you guys, those that you buy from him at anjtoys.com, get the mint cases. That's what he'll send you. But if he has a damaged one, instead of having to figure out what to do with it, send it to me because we don't care if the cards are mint or not. We just want to know what is inside. So let's go ahead and open it up. This is the international P case. A lot of times hobby dealers get the international cases first. Uh, Ken will also get U.S. cases about the time that stores will as well. So if you want to buy the case, you can. If you want to take a chance at a super, that sort of thing. Or just buy a case, share it with a friend, just get it yourself. Whatever you want to do, go to ANJ Toys. We did the end case, the U.S. end case. We'll do the uh, uh, USP case later. But let's start and just see what is inside. And we start with the Batman animated series. I could say it's a Batmobile, but it, and it is a Batmobile, but this time we get one that uh, we, I don't think we've seen this one before. Here is the first new model. We've already seen the custom 68 Camaro in the end case. Really dig that one. And here's another one, F-150 Ford Lightning Custom. EV, I think uh, Hot we or Matchbox did the stock version, the factory version of this. This is like a racing version of the EV truck. Kind of interesting. They've done some nice, cool stuff. You get the grill here, and you get different pieces like the forward on the back. I think that's a really cool model. Put that over here in the highlight pile. All right, Layin' Lowrider. We've seen that. Well, we haven't seen that before, but that's the color. Now there's the Charger Hellcat, and this is the Hot Wheels Water Bomber. It's a plane. Solero GT. There's a recolor of the Fantasy model with the new wheels. That's really cool. Porsche 928S Safari. That is was a new model in the last case. Dig that casting a ton. And a recolor of the Subaru WRX STI white to start. And here's a gray version. That's pretty clean. A lot of fans of that one. Mad Splash. It's a boat, but it also has wheels. There's the Jeep Scrambler. That looks cool. Is that a recolor? I can't remember. Have we seen this one before? I see. It's so funny how I just lose track. And there's the Fast Felion. H2 Go. It's a boat. There's a new casting. That's the hologram. Let's talk about this one. 57 Jeep FC. Phil Reelman showed this one. He did the last Jeep new model from a couple cases ago. And now we get this one, the FC, a classic cab over engine truck, pickup truck. You get the, well, actually, you get the engine in the back, right? Is that converted into a, is that an EV? He talked about it. I can't remember. We'll talk about it when we when we open that one up. A cool new model for sure. Rockin' Railer, Ford Thunderbird Pro Stock. Look at this, Dodge Charger 500. This looks, I mean, this is, it's got the striping on top, but this is like, almost looks like a throwback to the old muscle days of like 2004, 2005 when Hot Wheels was doing all the muscle cars. That's pretty cool. There was a Kmart purple Charger look very similar to that. Oh, there we go. 92 Dodge Viper RT10. We've shown this one before. New model, total stock, classic Viper. They had the three spokes. You know they had to do the Viper. That looks awesome. Great, great new model. There's the Bugatti, which is also a great new model from the last case. And here's the 71 Plymouth GTX in blue. That's pretty. Is it orange, I think, before that? Dodge Charger Drift, 88 Honda CRX in the C7Z06 convertible. Lightning Bug, another 57 Jeep FC in the Passen Gasser. Great name. Great name for a gasser. Hologram, Sand Burner, Honda Super Cub cast a, a Custom. Recolor, right? I feel like this one was red before of that model. It's going to fall over here on the side, so there it goes. Here's some of the crunched cards, but not, not a problem that it's the Skyfire, the Passing Gas, or the Lamborghini Reventon. We're going to obviously donate. I donate these cases, everything from these cases, to the Children's Hospital. And uh, as long as the, everything's sealed, they like them and they'll open them, the uh, kids, once they give them to them. 86 Ford Thunderbird again, Ram 1500 Rebel. Oh, that's a treasure hunt. And the 88 CRX, right? Yep. I think we've seen that Coast Patrol in a different casting. This time you see it there, and I just happened to be looking at it. And I was like, do I remember this casting? And I, I remember the casting, but I don't remember this version. That's cool, regular treasure hunt. They have really killed it with the regular treasure hunts this year. 
That's awesome. All right, let's get to the next half here. Already a good case. Some good new models with that Viper especially, and the Jeep, I think. Teed off two, haven't seen that in a while. There's a Batmobile and Land Rover Defender 110. You know, I thought that and when I did the end case that that was new to the end case, but it's, it, or that it was a repeat, but we'd seen it before, but actually it was new to the case, so now it's in the P case. Hot Wheels 4-track, there's the GMC Hummer EV. We had the, uh, this is recolor of the white one, and in the between we had Ken's Hummer, right? And the Fast Feed Lion from uh, Barbie. 62 Corvette, looks like a black and white model. Tesla Roadster, oh, this is, well, this is a recolor of the silver version, right? That looks cool. That's nice. I'll put that in the highlight pile. And then the tuned twin mill. Whoa, here we go. This is this is quite the trio. There's the Porsche 935. That would have been the Super in the last case. This is the Datsun Bluebird Wagon. That is the Super in this case, although that is not the Super, but it has the new wheels on it. This is the Super. Mattel sent it over. I've shown it before. I know a lot of people have seen it. So you can see both of these here. So purple for the regular with the cool wheels. Uh, kind of hot pink for the Super with also the cool four spokes. Those are awesome. Obviously highlights. We will uh, put those off to the side. Let's keep going here. Really like that Dotson Brutinator. Hot Wheels 4 track and the teed off too. All things we saw in the last case, Land Rover Defender, Ford Bronco R, which will be a Zamac and that beautiful Mazda Savannah RX-7. Just gorgeous in black. They've done a, they've, that casting's been brilliant. The whole time. Lamborghini Reventon, Corvette C7, and the Hot Wheels High. Keeping on going. There's another Porsche 935. Nice to see that my end case didn't have one at all, even super or the regular. Porsche 928 FS Safari again. And there's the recolor of the Cadillac Seville. So brown to start, red edition, right? And white and red. And then this version in blue. Oh, recolor of the Mitsubishi Pajero Evolution. Red to start, now it's in white. That's cool. That'll go in the highlight pile. There's another Batmobile. And there's the Honda CB750 Cafe. Dodge Charger Hellcat. Jaguar i -Pace e Trophy. It's nice to see they're putting at least two of the new models in these cases now. Because it seemed like for a while we are just going one per. Which was kind of, kind of difficult. 80 El Camino. That's a recolor. Ooh, Audi. 84 Audi Sport Quattro Recolor. Love the wheels. Love the deco on that. God, they've been really good to that casting as well. And then there's another one of the 62 Corvettes. And to finish, Mazda Savannah RX-7 again. There's another Bronco and there's another Hot Wheels High. End case was loaded with new castings with the Bugatti. This one, pretty good, right? We get highlights are the Audi Recolor of the Mitsubishi. These two for sure. I mean, anytime it's a 510 wagon. Leeway did a cool deco on this one. Had some fun with it. Really digging that one. Uh, digging the Tesla. Really cool regular treasure hunt. Here's your major highlight, I think, is the new Viper. Jeep is also really cool. This one is I, not my cup of tea, but just design-wise. But it's cool. It's unique. And I think that is it, right? Decent case. I wouldn't call it like a home run like some of the other cases, but the P case is pretty good and you can grab it at A&J Toys, so I appreciate Ken sending that over. Um, grab that or grab the end case, which is loaded with the Bugatti and everything else, but uh, I really do. We're coming, we're kind of, you know, we've got, that's, with P case, there's only Q case to go. We'll open up, um, we'll do a US P case soon, and then we'll open up the international and US Q cases once they come out, and then we're into 2024. So we got some Lamley Awards to do, right? We're creeping up on that. Anyway, you guys tell me what you think. What are the highlights for you? Let me know. Thanks, everybody. Bye.